Hey, what's going on everybody? Here we are, back at it again. Uh, fished this spot probably uh, about a week and a half ago. The water was up about two to three feet, so gonna see how conditions have changed. Uh, got some rain uh, last couple of days, so water's looking a little, little bit stained, and uh, we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna see if we can get a bite or two. So y'all stay tuned and hopefully we can find them. I think we're gonna start off with this uh, jerk bait by Z-Man. Um, got it on one of their uh jerk bait hooks forget the weight on this i can check the package here uh, i'm looking at a one eighth ounce uh, and we're gonna see if we can find something uh, i usually don't throw the soft plastic jerk baits usually more the x wraps um, but I think this one will allow us to cover kind of uh, the water column, you know, high and low, and see if we can find a bite that way. See how well this guy does. Might have to re-rig this fella. Also, uh, that jig might be a little light. We'll see here. We're gonna tuck in here and see if we can find a... Oh, there was something that came up and nibbled this guy. There he is. It was just kind of sitting there. What do we have here? A little redfish. Look at that. Man, talking about working the water column. This guy was a little bit further down, probably five, six feet down, I think. Heck yeah. Good start here. Thanks, buddy. A little 10, 11 incher. Heck yeah. Man. It's got a little keeper here to slide the, keep that bait in position or that lure. There he is. Felt that tap. Another little redfish. Heck yeah, man. They want this fluke. Come on, buddy. This is what's off. Some little rat of reds, but man. This is cool. This one's got some four spots on the side. Oh, easy, buddy. Easy, I gotcha. Man, that fin got me always does check them out thanks pal one spot on that side i think that fluke's gonna be good up here on the left side throw that guy out there there he is Man, he was tucked in that grass back there. Little bass here. Let's get this fella. Oh, closed bale. Let's see here. Come on, little guy. Don't get rowdy on me. <laughs> Tiny fella. He was... I wouldn't call that a pocket back there, but... It was one of those where it was pretty tight to the to the grass. That's probably where he was, staying just out of the current. Work along the grass here. I think we'll find a red or two. Like I've hit a, a slow area. There he 
There he is. Oh, heck yeah. I got one. Fluke, getting it. Thanks, buddy. There he is. Oh, flat boy. Look at that. Wasn't expecting this guy. Little fella, probably 10, 11 incher maybe. Heck yeah. Y'all check him out. What a, what a day. Beautiful, thanks buddy. Man. We are on to something today. The setup here, I got a four inch Z-Man jerk shad on a one eighth ounce uh, Z-Man weedless jig head. Um, and then this is 20 pound fluorocarbon as leader, um, 20 pound uh, braid as main line. I got a Daiwa BG 3000 rod is a uh, seven foot Shimano Claris. It's a medium fast action. As soon as it landed over there, he was on it. Feels like a redfish. Yes, that's a redfish. Oh, I lost him. <laughs> that was awesome, dude. Heck yeah. There we go. That looks good. We'll troll out of here. Let's see here as we troll along. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Mangrove. <clears throat> Let's see here, buddy. We're gonna get you unhooked. We're gonna let you go. Nice. Let's see here. All right, let's find him, paddle tail. Some even clobbered over there. No, oh, something tapped it, man. There he is. What is this? Redfish. Heck yeah, dude. Finally got one on the paddle tail. Oh, come on, buddy. Nice, heck yeah. Let's get them out here. There we go. Another three spotter on one side, two on the other. Thanks, buddy. He tapped it twice. Thanks. Let me see if there's a redfish out here in the middle. Nice little skip there off the water. This guy will catch him too. There's a small nibble there. There he is. What is this? Redfish. Yeah, another redfish. Got the rat reds hanging in here. I love it. I'll take these guys all day. Heck yeah. Is this the same guy? No, different guy. There we go, paddle tail, getting it done now. Let's 
see. It seemed like they were just nibbling at the tail. There he is. As soon as he landed over there, I felt that bite. Another one. It's like the same one. There's a school of little reds here. Love it. Thanks, buddy. Another three spotter on one side. Look at them. Check them out. Thanks, buddy. There he is. Yes, better one. Feels better. Yeah, a little bit better one. Got him. Nice. I mean, not that much better, but he bumped it. And then he ran with it. There we go. Thanks, buddy. Look at that. I got a little three spot one side pattern going on. Beautiful. I also forget that this is my medium light rod and sometimes the uh the fish feel a little bit bigger than what they really are. Um get some nibbles here. There he is, look. He came up and he grabbed it on the swim. Small guy. These are the guys that are they were nibbling at it. I'm not taking the whole thing. Make sure Mr. Gator ain't after me. But those guys are stacked in here. Which I'll take them. Catch them all day. It's good action. Three inch paddle tail. Quarter ounce jig head. As soon as it hit, they're in here. There he is. Better one. Feels better. What's getting worked right there? Let me see here. It's a decent one. Yeah. Come on, buddy. Nice. Easy. Gotcha, gotcha. Heck yeah. Thanks, buddy. Man. <laughs> Dude, we are on them. I love it. Like I said, these fish are sitting right here. Whatever it is that they're chasing. There he is. Man, a little bit better one? Maybe? Dude, stacked up. <laughs> yeah, nothing but rat reds here. Loving it. Keep an eye on Mr. Gator back here. Thanks. Man. <laughs> Can't beat this, y'all. Turn him up. I'm trying to find a bigger one in here. There he is. He grabbed it and swam with it. My head GoPro died, so I turned on this camera just to grab this fish and let him go. I'll get the other one set up here in a second, but we got him here. This guy did a grab and go. He just grabbed that lure and tried to take off. So, thanks, buddy. Let me try one more up this way, and then uh, we'll move to the left side of the channel here and work that area all the way up. I don't feel like I did anything in particular today other than really slow things down um, and just kind of work those lures closer to the bottom. All right, let's. Uh... Oh, he tapped it. There he is. Yes, redfish. He was right there. Nice. Come on, easy, buddy, easy. Another three spotter. <laughs> Let me 
Makes me think I'm catching the same fish. Maybe there was a second fish there because I got two, two thumps there. There he is. Yeah, buddy. Another little redfish. Man, I'm gonna have to check my line here in a second. Line's feeling good. Come on, buddy. Oh, that's the other way. Sorry. I'm trying to get the hook out, bud. Sorry. There we go. Thanks. So the setup here got a three-inch Z-Man paddle tail in the slam shaded gold color. Got a quarter ounce Texas Eye jig head, 20 pound fluorocarbon as leader, and then this is 10 pound Power Pro braid as the main line. The rod is a 610 uh, St. Croix Victory, and it is a medium light, extra fast action. There he is. Trying to grow. Oh, redfish. Is it or the biggest croaker I've ever seen? Man, this is the biggest croaker <laughs> I've ever seen. Check him out. Jeez, dude. There he is. A the better one. Could be the same redfish. Nope, it's a bass. This... Heck yeah. A little, little one pounder here. Thanks, buddy. Alrighty, y'all. That's gonna wrap it up for today. Man, what an awesome day on the water. Got a bunch of rat reds, uh, some bass, flounder. So that was super cool. But either way, I'm just glad I was able to make it out here and get on a solid bite. Appreciate y'all tuning in and watching. Hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, check out my other videos and consider subscribing. Catch y'all next time.